Boston Fed President Eric Rosengren spoke exclusively with Sarah Eisen, and it's moving the market. Sarah, what did he tell you? Keep the stimulus flowing. The economy certainly needs it. And pay attention. Eric Rosengren's views match Ben Bernanke's. They're a good clue as to what the Fed chairman is thinking. Rosengren is not ruling out another dose of liquidity, talking about QE3. Nothing's off the table. It depends on economic conditions. So we have to do whatever makes sense, given our outlook for the economy. He says, we don't have an inflation problem. There's nothing the Fed can do about high oil prices. He says, if we raise borrowing costs now, that will strain American consumers even more. And there's jobs, still far from normal, far from a level that Rosengren says he would feel comfortable making a move. We'd have to see much more job growth than we've seen to date. So we have an unemployment rate at 8.8 percent. Uh, in the longer run, we'd expect something closer to 5 to 6 percent. So we're well above where we would expect to be over a four or five year period. So we need to stimulate the economy enough to get much more job growth than we've experienced to date. Even if the United States adds another 200,000 jobs tomorrow, which is what economists we polled are looking for, Rosengren says he wants to see faster growth. His bet for unemployment at the end of the year, 8.5 percent. We're at 8.8 percent now, so that's not a whole lot of progress going into the rest of the year. The, di the big takeaway here, Eric, is do not expect higher interest rates in the U.S. anytime soon, unlike Europe and most of the rest of the world. And to stress the point, during our conversation, it was a 20-minute chat, he said the word accommodative, which is just Fed speak for easy policy, more than 10 times.